So, since Mr. Davis was kind enough to teach us about maps and figuring out directions on a map, it's important to know that we can use maps to find out a lot of different things. So, maps aren't always just, you know, outlines of countries. Sometimes they have information on them and we can read a map to find out important information about the area on the map that we're looking at. So, I want to talk to you guys today about what is called a natural resource. Raise your hand or give me a thumbs up if you've heard the words natural resource before. You have? What do you think it means other than what it says before? Um, I think it means like, uh, like, like things that you can find before or something like that. Yeah, in nature. Yes. So a natural resource is something that we use in nature. So anytime you have a glass of water, you're using a natural resource because we find water in nature. Anytime you sit at your wooden desk, you're using a natural resource because we get wood from trees that we find in the forest, right? Anytime that you, you know, write on a piece of paper, that also comes from trees. So natural resources are incredibly valuable, valuable, valuable. I got there. Yeah. And <laughs> and it is important to know where we can find natural resources. So I'm going to hand out this map, and this is a map of the United States. All the states are labeled, and on this map, they have different little images that tell you where we can find different natural resources. Do you guys have any questions so far? Okay, cool. I printed out way more of these than I need. I printed out 12. Now, I don't need to give you all of them. I'm just gonna give you one. Here you go. There you go. So let's start right at home. You guys don't need to write anything on this paper just yet. I just want you to look at it. Now, you guys see a couple of symbols inside the state of Illinois, right? Now, how do we know what that symbol means? Can anybody tell me how we know what that symbol means? That's okay. Oh, Mia. You have a yes, very good. You have a key over on the left side, and it has all the little symbols that you'll find on the map, and it has what each symbol means. So, you see the top one is a little image of a fish. Next to it, it says fish. Now, if we look in the ocean, around the outside of the country, on the coast, we'll find the fish. That makes sense, right? You're not going to find the fish on the land. Now, there's others that are very important. Coal, oil, forest, gold, copper. What symbol do you see in Illinois right where we are? So you're going to have to look at the symbol and then look over at the key to see what it means. Yes, honey. Coal. Coal. Very, very good. And you see two symbols of that coal, right? Now, do you think that means that there's only two pieces of coal in the entire state of Illinois? No. No. But it means that in those spots, that's where we find a lot of coal. And this is important to know because the natural resources in an area can help us, A, figure out where they are, and B, they dictate what a lot of people do for work in that area. So if there's a lot of coal in an area, you know, like there is in certain parts of Illinois, we know that there's gonna be people, miners, going to get that coal. Does that make sense? Yes. So why don't we pick a different state? Let's look at Texas. Who could find Texas? Jada, what resource is there a ton of? in Texas? Oil. Oil. Very good. So we know that in Texas, there's people working on oil rigs, trying to dig out oil, right? Mm -hmm. Now we already talked about the fish. What about, who can tell me a state where they see forest? Now you Wisconsin. Wisconsin's got a forest. Very good. Who can tell me a different state where they see forest? Kelsey. Oregon, yes, exactly, very good. 
Mia, do you have a different one? Washington. Washington, yeah, that whole area, that northwest. Thank you, Davis, for teaching us directions. But uh, yeah, has a lot of forest and a lot of lumber. So it makes a lot of sense when we think about it that in those areas where there's a lot of forest, we're going to have lumber, right? We're going to have people working in the woods trying to cut down trees and make sure that the rest of us that may not have forests can still use wood. Does that make sense? Can we give a thumbs up? Does that make sense? Do you guys have any questions? Okay. So what I want you to do right through that. Well, you guys understood it, so that's fine. Uh, what I want you to do is I want you to pick three states. Pick any three states. And I want you to write down what natural resources those three states have. And you can do it on the white part on the bottom of your map. So give me a thumbs up if we understand the directions. Okay, I'll give you guys a couple minutes. 